What's going on guys? Welcome back to PFI Speed. What a weekend. Super humbling, wild. But I'm getting here today and uh, see if we can't make some hot rods. What's up, Gordita? What up? What are you up to? Not much. What's up, dude? Holy mackerel. This is awesome. awesome. <laughs> Literally. Wow. That's looking professional. Yeah. yeah. Holy crap. That's fantastic. FedEx got here this morning and I was like, we gotta set it up before it gets here. <laughs> <laughs> that is cool. This is awesome. Unreal. Brittany outdoing herself again. Making us look good. It's pretty awesome, man. It's crazy to think. It sounds like we got a second one coming that doesn't say official merchandise that we can park show enough for the brother-in-law or the bully or twin turbo Todd or Gordo McSavage over here's hot rod. Pretty cool. I'm floored, dude. Yeah. <laughs> this is cool. I walked in and it's just like, bah! So I first walked in, they were setting it up and they were like, go outside. <laughs> so I went outside and started the camera. <laughs> but it's cool. Super stoked. Can't wait to set it up. Get the Cleason cars or street car takeover or PSCA and uh, really get things going. This is rad. We're trying. I'm going to be back on uh, show enough today. I've got a couple little hot rods I got to tinker on as well, but I want to get my twine done. I don't have much left. I think just some stuff in the rear. And uh, then, then lay it out and get busy stringing or see what I need to get busy stringing. So, awesome. What's up, Jam? We got a package from our buddies over at Honda Rescue Garage. Oh yeah? Yeah. I figured it might be something cool. Todd thought it was my leveling kit for my truck. My truck's not a Honda. Start with the note. I like notes. Me too. I feel like the world's lost touch from notes. Yeah. Well, it's like you just gotta write yourself a good letter. Rollover hazard. Oh, those are great. Brent, put this to good use. We know you'll come out on top from all of us at HRG. Send us a donation there. Oh, that's awesome, man. Yeah. Keep ripping this hashtag on the bottom. And then, got some Doritos. Woo! Dorito guy now. Hi, right, Doritos. He's the best, man. Look at this. Awesome. Nutter butters. Oh, stuff. man. Thank you so much. Honda Rescue Garage. You guys, check out his channel. This is unreal. It is, man. Thank you so much. We appreciate it so much. This is just wild. Unbelievable. Very humbling. Whew. Damn. Yep. out these springs guys this is awesome how stinking cool is that yeah Jonathan knee hard at it love it
pocket or something. Little, little air pocket. They're pretty much all on top of each other. Pretty good numbers right on top of each other, every one of them. Okay, a little warm. How fast is Bruce? Swapping tires on the dyno. That is. Look at all that. This is just awesome. The technology that's in these right now, that's just, It's amazing. It is great. Oh. The carburetor's going. All right, so we made a carb adjustment and they're getting ready to go again. Let's check this out. Got it all watered back up, cooled off. Got that tire changed. This is so cool. Jonathan, you've got one rad ride, that's for sure. Gonna go toss her up. I think goof. Yeah. Sounds great, huh? Yeah. Yeah, it sounds amazing. Well, when the <laughs> fan hits this rear lip here, it gets a lot of downforce, gets more traction on the dyno. Huh. These are just little, like Volkswagen motors. Right yeah. yeah. Whatever. <laughs> this, this is awesome.
torque, which I care about torque yep. for the horsepower. Well, it made the most torque that. and the most horsepower. At the least horsepower, it made the most torque. Yeah, yeah, right, that's true. I don't get that. That could have been just a little temperature deal right there. Yeah, it must have been. Just that. because it was the fresh, but but the average is better overall on all of those than where you were. Yeah. I mean, that's up quite a bit. Five, pretty. Well, yeah, five from the first one. Yeah. From the first peak one. That's not a lot. But that one, we didn't, <laughs> man. I kill, I kill for five and is. I kill for, what was it? I mean, the torque is another 10. Woo! That was a good change. Yeah. It wasn't really that much different. It might have not been, but it, it sure acted different. All right. Dang, that was sweet. Just the sound. I can get all, whew, give me that all day. That is so cool. What a beautiful ride. It's bright. Oh, it's bright. So it stinks I couldn't show you the dyno numbers this hot rod made. But if you comment down below in the first few days this video is released, and I see that you guessed the exact dyno number, I'm gonna send you out one of our wanted posters with a note from all of us here at the shop. So good luck and uh, can't wait to see what you guys comment below. All right guys, so you guys have heard me talk about wheelie bars on the front wheel drive cars. Well, we're gonna put one on the bully like we have one on Tom's. When we were first designing the traction bars, Sean and I had a kind of a pretty good idea I feel. The top bar of the wheelie bar itself, or traction bar, we wanna put an air cylinder on so we can control basically the top bar going down into the ground and coming back up. So Bruce, who you guys have seen um, help Fong with his suspension, found these little air rams and uh, we're gonna try this out. Let's see if it lifts this corner. Let's see if it'll lift the car. <laughs> <laughs> like nothing. That was easy. Dude, that was so easy. Of course. Let's do it That's again. Engine Let's do it again. So, so okay, why that's exciting is, Sean, can I take that real quick for me? I'm gonna show these guys what we're up to. We want to face it this direction, okay? And it'll have a rocker off the face of it and come up to the top bar. And basically when this comes out, when I let off the, when I let off the trans brake, we'll have this kick out, sending the wheelie bar into the ground, helping us get traction on the front. And then we can time out how long this is out there and it'll just pick up down track. And I think that's a great way to try to get traction with a front wheel drive car. Ooh. It's kind of exciting. I think it is, because this is the kind of stuff that I like to, solve we're gonna keep playing here hope you guys are stoked with this little thing thanks bruce for uh bringing this over this is yeah. pretty neat man he does stuff with cnc's all the time so ready <laughs> bro it looks the whole front end Woo! do it again almost like a quick jack almost like a quick jack dude that's pretty impressive that is impressive i'm stoked man obviously and Dustin's car, as you guys can see, is really taking shape. I love his valve cover. Um, brings uh, awareness to autism, so it's pretty cool. Pretty awesome deal. And then, I mean, this is a dart block Todd put together. Yep. 95 millimeter stroke, tall deck. Tall deck. This, this, is a, this is a unit. This is pretty cool. Should be pretty fun. So it's got a PPG trans, the bill of bell housing, all the good stuff. Good job guys but that was fun right that's yeah, that's, that's awesome. pretty cool yeah that was impressive yeah so that's the top bar of the wheelie bar on uh, the bully stoked you could <laughs> share that i mean i'm a little ways away from building those bars but a part came in and i want to share it with everybody yeah yeah that's now we cool. know what we got to do to build them now. yeah now we know <laughs> that's a little motivating in the subject <laughs> it really yeah. is Man, I gotta get Jamie. Hold on. We're gonna get Jamie's reactions. Hey, Jamie. I know you're hard at work on your little hot rod here, but uh, I've got something that's needing your attention. You have to check this out. Okay. This is awesome. 
So this is like the area the wheelie bar is going to come out so that rocker would be inside inside the back here. So ah, something that we can look forward to building. This is going to be cool. Coming. So you remember my wheelie bar idea? Yeah. Remember how I was talking about how to rocker and a... Yeah. Okay. Bruce came by today and brought these because of my idea. What and is it? Now we're going to show you. We're going to okay. test this for you. Yeah, yeah, show me. Did we jump on the car? Ready? Yeah. The whole front end of the engine <laughs> can, dude. It was getting off. It that picks up the load whole load on car. some wheelie bars. Damn, that's a single. Do it yeah. again. Like now. Oh and it seems my very quick friends. too. <laughs> Literally. Is this just a little air cylinder? Yeah. See. But it's got the mount holes. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's perfect. That's what it is, what it's called. And that thing straight works. That's exactly what we were talking about. Like yep. I didn't picture it like that, you know? But now that we've, we're using it, it's like, of course that's what it's gotta be. I know I've tried looking at some of them online and just the way they're rated and stuff. I was like, right. I don't know what kind of force that actually exerts. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Interesting. I dig it. Yeah, me too. Yeah, tell Rob what we're doing here. Yeah, I'm gonna mount them this way, inside, right? So underneath this, they'll be mounted this way. They'll have a rocker that comes up, and then, you know, the in between the rocker and then the upper wheelie bar here, and then come down, and then when you turn it on, yeah, when I let off the trans brake, then it activates air it, up, air it up, slam the bars, slam the bars down, accelerate forward, and then, yeah, you know, 330, 400 feet out. Timer to let it bleed out. Yeah, let it bleed out and take, then you don't have any drag for the top end. That's what I was thinking. I think that's pretty slick. Sounds like hot roddy fun to me. <laughs> it's cool. So it would work too, probably just putting one in the middle. Put an anti roll bar in there, put an ear off the bottom. That's that such way, a good idea. Because you already got the, yeah. Off of one lever point. That's cool. That's a good idea too. So we're we're thinking of all the ideas. You can see all the string for show enough. I got my board over there, so I'm about to get that all going too. So a lot going on. I just wanted to share a little bit, and Jamie's just about done with his hot rod. He's tinkering on the fuel tech. Yeah. Trying to get that going. And uh, we'll be down on this soon and getting it to the track. So and Todd's got his engine together, so it's going to the track yeah. soon. Just got a new dash. Oh yeah, he got a Holly dash, so you're all yeah, set up. Dash. Woo! Very cool. Yeah, fancy. <laughs> all excited. Fancy, fancy. Yep. That's gonna do it for this episode, guys. Appreciate you watching. Give us a like, subscribe. We'll see you guys all tomorrow.